over in the background there is the remainder of Camelot Theme Park. Camelot Theme Park, welcome to our final visit to the forgotten place. This is it, we are taking our final look at Camelot Theme Park. We're quite close to it. Uh, we've been here before many, many years ago, took some pictures. Um, but it's the first time we've actually been here and done any kind of filming. Now we're not going to get very close obviously, we know uh, it would be trespassing to go past the main gates and things, so we're not going to do that. For obvious reasons, it's probably a real hazardous site in there, it's completely fallen apart over the years. But we'll point out now the wonderful entrance this used to have. You know, we came to the park in 2007 for the opening of Nightmare and sadly, Nightmare wasn't built and wasn't open. But all this here, this was beautiful white, lovely buildings, really, you know, really imposing on. You have wonderful gates um, as you kind of entered and it looked very, very castle-like. It was stunning, stunning. You know, the car park was full, there were loads of people here and there was a lot going on. And when you walked in, uh, on the right hand side you had a little log flume, you had a little crazy caterpillar as well and then of course you had the big swinging ship in front of you. The big swinging ship is the one that went to Pleasureland Southport. In fact a lot of the rides went to Pleasureland Southport. Not all of them but a lot of the rides went to Pleasureland Southport. Uh, that includes the big wheel which is still on site although not used and that does include the swinging ship which has now been kind of made into a rock garden. Some of the other rides most of them went to Gulliver's. So Gulliver's got the balloons, they got the little go gator, um, they also got the slides as well, the water slides which they had. But it was just such a lovely park. Um, and you know, this is really all there is now. I mean, you know, whilst you may have seen some drone footage, they've allowed drones to go in before, we're not gonna advertise people that have broken into the park to have a look. There is still one standing feature. One standing feature which you saw at the beginning of the video, which was Nightmare. So when we came, Nightmare was shut, gutted gutted nightmare was shut I never got on it never got back to the park before it closed now the park opened in 1983 and then shut 3rd of September 2012 and you know towards the end we felt quite lucky to get on the rides we got on so they had Excalibur here um, the in inverted uh, swing ride which I believe also stayed in the country not 100% sure where it went. I think it went as OMG at Southport as well. You will have seen that on some of our previous photos on our website. And then of course, um, you had the rack. And the rack was a very unique ride. Uh, if you haven't seen it, um, description below, we'll put a video to it. We did take a video to it. Bear in mind it's old, please take into account it's old. It's not gonna be an HD or anything. But what an attraction that was. And we were so lucky because that was up and down all day and it was removed uh, the next season. And then rides started getting removed and they never really got replaced and Nightmare didn't quite do enough to pull people in. Uh, access to here is really good. The M6 is just over here. It's not far away. We've just come over it to get through the park, but it just didn't have enough going for it. Now. They wanted to close it, they wanted to put housing on here, and it's been declined. It's been declined twice now. Twice it's been declined. And you know, will they be able to do it? The hotel is still open, as you can see here, and obviously where we drove up to. And Nightmare is in a bit of limbo at the moment. Uh, we thought it was going to Southport Pleasureland. I don't think it is. I think they've still got one of the trains, but I don't think it is. And it's in a bit of limbo. We kind of know what's going on with it, but it's in a bit of limbo, and it's still here still here seven years after the park shut you know we don't get a lot of abandoned theme parks in the uk and generally when we do attractions are stripped out of them but nightmare is still very much there and was in running condition up to a couple of years ago and i'd love to get on it i'd love for it to stay in the uk but i just don't think it is now i think it's going to be going but this is camelot It's a short video, it's a short video because we're saying goodbye. We don't plan to ever come back here again unless it opens as a theme park. We haven't been here for about five years, to be honest, since it's shut and there were a few more things here to look at. You know, it's really derelict since the last time we come and took some pictures. Um, you know, and with the hotel open, it's gutting that this used to be a thriving theme park and it no longer is. So yeah, we're saying goodbye to Camelot. We may have only visited uh, May only visited once, but we had a great day out. The live horse shows were amazing. Uh, you know, the jousting they did, the atmosphere was really good, the staff were really good. You know, the rides, however basic they were, some of them were really well themed. It just fitted really well together. You know, the diesel powered dragon ride which they had uh, was fantastic. I've never been on another one since. Um, 
and you know that as well had the train at Southport but the track the track was never going to be moved you know they, they could have put it on anything to be fair but it was never going to be moved and that's now long disappeared from there as well so history of some of the rides are vanishing from across the UK but Gulliver's still hold some of the attractions here from Camelot Southport still have one or two but other than that quite honestly the forgotten theme park Camelot theme park one of the last ones to uh one of the last ones to close in the UK along with Pleasureland up in Cleethorpes but we're saying goodbye to Camelot and hopefully hopefully Nightmare stays in the country but if it doesn't saying goodbye to Nightmare as well thank you for joining us remember to subscribe give us a like this is Camelot theme park leave in the comments did you ever come here what did you think what was your favorite ride and of course did you get on Nightmare we'll see you next time